Pooh's back. Hmm? <laughs> Is that seriously all you're going to do? You're not going to say, hello everybody, look at me. Uh, they can't look at me. I'm back. Uh, for uh, uh, this occasion. Yes, we we had to. Uh, this one looks nice. See, almost like a Switzerland. I'm getting this. I had to uh, get a game selected that Stinky was prepared to play. <laughs> Other... Well, someone download the game, the wrong horror game, Anja. That's true too. Uh, and okay. I don't want to risk it. Otherwise, you have to open another screen. <laughs> <laughs> Streaming. Another one is not fun for the porter. That's true. All right, now, uh, actually, I'll start playing the music, I guess. Is that what you want there, Stink? You want a bit of pumping music for yourself? I did not request that. There you go, there's some pumping music. Come on. And who's there? It's oh, the random's there. And I'm sorry, I can't, can't actually read, I believe that's Korean. So if you can give me a name to say uh, for you that's in English. Oh, I, I don't know how to say that. Uh -huh. It's in Korean. Uh -huh. uh, how are you, Random? And how are you, our Korean friend? I can... Hang on, hang on. I'll do this. Yeah, hang where's on. your translate? Yeah, where's my date, translate? Huh? I'm sorry. We can't... Well, you can speak a tiny bit of Korean, can't you? No, Stinky. not really. My current friend kind of went back home or work at other place now. Have not much knowledge about it. Kind right. of forgets things as well. Okay. Um, just bear with me. I'm just doing the typing of the... Get back in there. Come on. So we'll do that. Uh, now, next thing, I've got to do a poll. So just bear with me oh. while I do that. This is taking a long time. Start a poll. It is taking a while to load it. Well, it's got start there. Did you press yeah. that? It just hit 100%. Should I click start now? Yep. Oh. And it's going to take forever. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. That's right. Um, mysterious hey. experience. Punishing. Can I change to girl? Uh, you should be able to. Uh, just bear oh, with me, our girl? Korean friend. Um, I will be able to translate in a. Uh, I'll be able to translate in a second. I am. Oh, my typing is so bad. This looks like Korean. No. Hang on. This is still male. Oh. Um, All right, so that's it. the poll done. Let's um, see. I am fine and thank you. Oh, awesome. So you can speak uh, English. I can always type to you in Korean. It just takes a little bit longer. And Miss CM's there as well. Hello. It's good to see you again, I think. I believe you've been in the streams before. Uh, have a blessed night, she says. So... For us, it's uh, midday, so we'll be uh, staying up for a little while. I assume Stinky slept in today. What are you it? talking about? I slept at one o'clock. <laughs> well, whose fault is that for going to bed so late then, huh? Hey, you can't blame me for that. What, going to bed late? Mm. You do it every night. You are the one who keep me in bed during the day. Oh, do Excuse I? Excuse me, I can't do anything. I don't know what you're, you're talking about. So, um, and again, sorry to the, the uh, person that's got the Korean name. I'm just going to call you Mr. Korea at the moment <laughs> until you tell me otherwise. Uh, we're both fine. Uh, how are you? All right, so that's that done. Now, just bear with me. I've still got a tiny bit more background work to do. And then we'll get into the topics of the day. So, first of all, I guess Halloween is looming upon us. Does anyone have any Halloween plans? Um, I don't think I can do that. Survey? Do it what? Oh, actually, yes, I can. 
All right, so that's done. Um, I am sorry, I can't speak English very well. Okay. That's okay. We can continue to chat in Korean. Whoop. I just need a little time to use Google whoop, to use Google Translate. Kane's there as well. Hang on. Uh, so Pudok, good news. The friend star Michael Perry. Oh well, that's not good news, is it? Oh, yeah, he said bad news, I meant. Michael Perry's passed away. To I from don't know. Friends. He's the... Is that Joey from memory? In Friends? Um, no, we can't... Except for... Uh, well, Karimaska, Anjin-san, Moshi Moshi. These are about the extent of my Japanese words. Unless it's sushi, teriyaki, sushimi, that sort of thing. Um... Sorry, and what's this? Say some Korean. You can speak a tiny bit. No, I know the swear word. We oh. want that. Only say a few words in uh, Japanese. So for everyone so else, so you want Korean or Japanese? Well, he just asked, "Do you speak Japanese?" So uh, for everyone else in the chat, if you want to help us. Uh, communicate with our Korean viewer that would be most helpful I will do it in the Google translates but I am a little bit slow you are um, very slow thank you friend okay so he is certainly communicating so apparently Mike Perry died from drowning wow I wouldn't have thought drowning yeah that's Where? That would be an unusual uh, way to pass away at his age, I would think. How old? Well, he'd be in his 50s now, surely. Friends was a, a show from a long time ago, yeah? Do you know Do you know Friends or you don't? I kind of know. I watched a few episodes, but not a lot. Right. Uh, da -da -da -da. Now, can I rely on you just to do your thing while I do my thing? Just for a moment there, Stinky. I'm going to get platinum. Blood. All right, so I'll be right back. Just bear with me and listen to Stinky's wonderful commentary. Here we go. Uh-huh. Select back. Um, I'm done with this one. How can I move on? Um, back. 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 Eh. Doesn't like me choose that color. Uh, how about that? <laughs> We're never gonna get into the, the farming, I reckon. But I'm not gonna harass you anymore for picking characters and whatnot, because Red December says it's enjoyable to watch. Um, okay, just bear with me for a moment. How are things in Korea? Oh, that sounds almost Asian-style music right there, doesn't it, Stinky? Didn't you add one who picked Now, I have noticed that people have... Well, it's 100% votes for yes, people have experienced mysterious things. So do tell more. Because I must admit, last night I spent a lot of... The reason that was the, the poll question, perhaps one of the topics of the day, was um, I was watching a lot of those mystery videos last night. The scary ones that Stinky doesn't like me watching late at night. Uh. <laughs> and I tell you, with with today's modern age... Ah, oh, there's Mitch. Uh, we're good. How are you? Now, if he likes, he can always join in the, the live stream as well now. We start a party we do, Stinky, that you weren't a part of last week. Uh-huh. So I'll leave it up to him. Oh, there's Kate as well. Good to see you too. We're having some of the old DLG showing up. And uh, again, because 
Mitch and Kate are there. We do have a Korean person in the stream. So feel free to communicate with them in Korean if you've got access to Google Translate. Uh, and he's just said hello everyone. Actually, I'm making the assumption it's a he too as well because I can barely, I can barely make out the um, avatar or, or whatever it's called. So um, I am letting people know to chat to you in Korean to hopefully they can also use Google Translate. And I know if Red shows up, she's always very good with uh, helping out with the, the people that speak languages that we don't. All right, so we we'll get back in there. And how have you been, Kate and LMAO? Uh, I saw you live and decided to say hi, but I have to go to my family is having a party for Halloween. So uh. just before you go, Kate, we were asking, or Stinky was asking me, when is Halloween? Because they're all calling it Halloween. You said people are saying Halloween weekend this weekend. Yeah. But it's not Halloween yet, right? That's on the 30th or the 31st? That's my question. Don't ask me back. No. Uh, oh, Mitch also can't stay too long. Good luck with the game. I personally uh -huh. tried it and just enjoyed driving really fast. So, uh, oh, that's a shame Mitch has got to go because he's played it. And from what I can tell, it is multiplayer. So you can play. And there's Red. I was just talking about you. We have a Korean person in the, the live stream at the moment. So feel free to, to say hello to them in Korean and or Japanese. So I think they can speak uh, Japanese as well. We'll hopefully pop back into the stream later. All good. We understand people are busy and they don't always have time to, to waste listening to old Uncle Poodot rant about nothing. So I'm still waiting to hear about these mysterious experiences. I'm trying to think of new things because I have mentioned some of the, the weird things that I've seen in the past. Uh, I will also say I was watching some of those uh, ring, what is it? The, the ring video, door, door ring, ring bell, bell ring. I don't know what it's called. The, it's the uh, the ringer that you can put on your house that also has uh, video recording. And in America anyway, wow, they have lots of strange things happening at their front doorsteps. I'm really appreciative of the fact that our next door neighbor's got a ring camera. I feel somewhat protected by that, but uh, we will have to get one ourselves. I, I would highly recommend getting one of those. Um, Kate says it's October the 31st, stinky. Ah, so there you go, it's not Halloween weekend for us technically. Uh, I'm hopefully, I uh, read that already, and I'm doing well too. On a few days ago, I won my first basketball game. 0 to 21, you didn't just win, you dominated. My goodness, they didn't even get to scoring Kate's game. Mm. How good is that? Congratulations, yeah, Kate. Do you, do you play a particular position or is it rotating? I used to play guard until till I got short. I was very tall when you're, I was... You are very tall. Well, I haven't grown since uh, year eight or form two or whatever, like the second... Why do you stop so fast? I don't know. I do not know. I was the same height then. So I was tall year seven, year eight, a little bit of year nine, and then year ten everyone started to grow. So that didn't really help. And then I became a shorty and no longer good at basketball. That's what happens. So, what about you, Stinky? Do you have any scary experiences? Stardust mysteriously ate swallowed my Burger King Whopper today. <laughs> oh. Red, I'd hate to... Uh, Hate to burst your bubble there, but I don't think it's much of a mystery when it comes to Stardust. From all of the videos I've seen, uh, they'll tuck into basically any food you present them. <laughs> we could say the same thing about rat bag. Food disappears around her on the regular, doesn't it, Stinky? Huh? Uh, you know when you make 
make the bacon and egg roll for me this morning and put on my <laughs> laps. She woke up right away and like walking, walking towards me and like, no, no right back, that's mine. Well, you can have some of the rash, but that's about it. That's right. Because who made who a bacon and egg sandwich today? Tootin. And my egg still got some egg yolk in there. We've just got PewDiePie join us. <laughs> Hello, PewDiePie. I suspect it's not the real PewDiePie. It might, well, to be honest, I think I actually know uh, this person because I checked their channel out earlier today, if I'm not mistaken. And sort of left a quick hello and I can't remember what the video was, but I'm pretty sure I said hello on their channel. So shout out to them. And if you are the real PewDiePie, whoa! <laughs> Can we get a shout out from you? <laughs> oh, you got the, the trucker thing going there already. So what are some what are of the things... Doing? No, you got to learn how to drive, Stinky. You still on your loser plates? No. You've I'm got a full license, anything. haven't you? Why they park like this? So stupid. You gotta reverse. Figure out how to put it in R. And you've got. Or you can honk. What's the point? <laughs> I don't know. You've got controls L1, there. L1. So where am I going to start? I'll start with uh, the thing that people uploading stuff from all over the world about strange things in the sky. That kind of, and I'm not just talking about the UFO footage, because you wow. see a fair bit of that. But I saw one the other day where, uh, I believe it was a, a video from China, wow. where they had a, a big circle in the sky. Like this big halo looking thing as if, I don't know, maybe God or Jesus was there. Something like that. Zoom! <laughs> No, I want to get out. I don't want this car yet. Um, 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 um. Let me out. And uh, just Let me a, out. just as a bit of a hint to everyone, this is how Stink Pants drives in real life too. You got to wear a helmet when you're in the car with her, and every pedestrian on the road should probably wear a helmet too. I'm kidding. You're a good driver, Stinky. You are. You're very cautious, aren't you? You treat everyone else like they're idiots on the road. That just makes you more cautious. That was the advice that my uh, father gave to me when first, or us when we first started driving, is just think of everyone else as an idiot on the road and they don't know what they're doing. And then you're most likely never to be in an accident. And I guess it's held true because whilst I have been in an accident and so has my sibling, it's always been... What? A rear-ending situation so we're not actually doing anything wrong in my case I was just parked at a set of red lights what the lights were red what am I supposed to do I stay still and a car rammed rammed from behind and that's happened to uh, my sibling as well the same situation so there you go um, what else have we got have you seen any mysterious things online stinky online no yeah. I, I avoid watching this stuff I saw I'm with like you. Some of it's not bad. So I saw another one where this was from America, I believe in, I want to say Dakota, where it was showing these these clouds that it almost looked like a, oh, how would I describe it, like an overpass or something in the sky. And he was saying that it looked like the clouds were rolling backwards. And I couldn't really see but that, but they were a different colour to the rest of the clouds in the sky. It was very unusual to see. Oh, and here's one. I, I've discovered a new fear, Stinky. I don't like stink, ho uh, stink holes. What? I don't like stink holes either, but I don't like sinkholes. Uh -huh. Imagine, you know, life is all whoa, normal. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're sitting in your living room playing farm simulator games and all of a sudden the earth opens up beneath you and you know sometimes you don't get out of those holes sometimes they're shallow but people have certainly lost their lives in sinkholes before yeah and how do they start what well, creates them what what is it can be 
because well there's many theories because you build too much crap on the land and <laughs> true true and also you use the underground water we don't use a lot here but in my country we use a lot of underground water passage so, so you we suck it up to use and therefore you know when it's dry out so you do get a lot of sinkholes in your country uh, not they... a lot got a little bit but well how about they're not uncommon because you don't really hear of sinkholes here. They do happen, but you don't really hear that it happens that much. Uh, where are you from, Poodot? Uh, we are from Australia. So let me just type that in. Why is... Well, uh, we are from... Poodot, I cannot Australia, do a farming. But I can't even drive this thing! You're driving, you're doing all right. Now, can I say your country or no? Yeah. Okay. But Australia. <laughs> the other country. Uh, I, don't, I don't have to. Yeah. Everyone okay. knows why they, you keep asking me. That's Something true. Something you shouldn't say, you say all the time. Accidentally. Right, really. And no. It's accidental. I don't, I don't know how to keep my no, mouth quiet. No, no, no. And thank you so much, Red. She's actually speaking a fair bit of Korean there, which is awesome. I really love Red. She's, she's such a kind-hearted person. Helps us out in every stream. But so does all the DLD. I'm not, uh -oh. not singling them out and saying that they're not also awesome. <laughs> Stinky, stay on the road. Not easy to drive in this thing. You're getting the hang of it. Sort of. <laughs> All right, go for a drive in the field then. Um, so this game's graphics aren't that bad. Yeah, I agree, PewDiePie. So we we tend to only play the the free games. Although if we ever hit the 10k sub mark, oh, whoa, we'll, whoa, whoa, we'll end up whoa, whoa. Uh, buying some games that have been requested to play. Ah. And this one was uh, free on the, the PlayStation. So if you Actually, have a... This is a farming game, what, what I'm doing here. <laughs> You're not farming yet, but... Do you, uh, what am I doing? Do you know wow. where your farm is? Or you don't even know where your farm is? That's where I came from. <laughs> and any tips right. as well? So unfortunately, Mitch, uh, he mentioned that he's played this game. So he'd be good for tips, but he's, he wasn't able to stick around. Hopefully he'll come back later. And um, I'm always impressed, i got to say, PewDiePie with most of the games that are out these days because I grew up on an Atari whoa, whoa. and the graphics there weren't so great. Playing games like Pac-Man and Donkey Kong back in the day. Isn't it? That's old school stuff. Maybe I should just go back. <laughs> yeah, maybe. The problem, problem is I don't know how to get out of the car. You would. <laughs> I don't know how to get out of the car. Well, you can do. Ah, and now I'm kind of lost a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> I think if you do the options thing, it'll tell you what the controller ah, controller does. What's that? You're doing donuts and everyone else's farm there. <laughs> what's this? This isn't quite like Farmville, is it? You seem to be able to get off your property quite easily. Oh, another car. Hello. Help, help, help. I think you're going to turn this into GTA while you're at it. Uh, Moonshadow had surgery, cyst removal, and just got his stitches out today. Oh, I'm don't sorry. Go there now. No, don't, don't, go there. don't do that. Um, I hope Moonshadow recovers quickly. It's not fun when you have a cyst operated on. That's happened to me twice already. Isn't it? Oh, just twice? Okay. Is it? Like actual operation in the hospital. I believe it's oh, only been I, twice. I don't know your first one, I just remember the second. Unless it counts you popping them. But you always got cease. There, yeah, that's and true. And countable. Pop up everywhere, don't they? Um, did you take video footage of it, Red? They probably wouldn't let you into the theatre. But uh, again, we talked about this in previous streams that <laughs> Stinky doesn't like it when I do it, but I don't mind watching the pimple popping videos. He's mad. 
if you haven't seen Sister the Century, you got to watch that. Yeah, all those games what? were pixelated. That's right, PewDiePie. So back in the day, it was. Um, we still thought it was impressive because, uh, I mean, I am showing our or my age, I should say. Stinky's not as old as I am, but um, when we first started, you had to, pretty much the the um, games in an arcade, which I personally never. We never really went to arcades when we were young, but that's probably just um, us, because a lot of my friends did. Uh, also, the town we grew up in didn't have an arcade, so it's not like you could do that. So people would have Atari, or they'd have the little Game Boys, and that was our initial introduction to gaming. So when the PlayStation and the Xbox came along, I was still blown away. For example, um, what is it, Call of Duty? Even the original Call of Duty, when I first played that, I thought the graphics were amazing because it's not something we were used to playing. Um, so there you go. What else you got, Stink? Nothing. Ah, don't get stuck on a rock. Oh, you might be in trouble there, Stinky. No, you're good. And there's, a, there's a white car coming. Go crash into it. You almost did. Anyone, <laughs> You just went right over the rock again. <laughs> well, there's another mysterious thing to talk about. Stinky's driving abilities. <laughs> it's a mystery how you... Uh, you might have to get out of that car if you can't. How do I get out of the car? I want to know. So, uh, if you press maybe that button... Does that give you scroll on down on the left there? What? Well, there's a help thing. There's some settings. There's some game settings. That's not really helping either, is it? You got a lot of farming stuff there, but not actually doing any actual farming thing. I want to go home! <laughs> I don't want to drive! <laughs> but I got on this thing and then I can't get out. Yeah, you did. Uh, I can't believe you dri drove straight over it again. After you managed to get unstuck. Rah! I mean, I'd get out and push, but I can't get into the game. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. Can you do a pick target location? No, I maybe not. Back more person. Um, um. Still? No. Huh? What? Oh, you're on a tractor now. What happened? Well, you got saved. That's good enough. Is that you? Did you pick a female? I don't know if that female or not. It looks like female. I think that's you. It must be you. You're the one. Here we go. Now go find a, a field to plough. Ah, <laughs> oh dear. I'm all talked out already. We've barely gotten started, Stink. What do you got to say about that? I don't like driving. <laughs> have you ever driven a tractor? No. Nope. I have. I've driven a few tractors in my time before I was old enough to have a licence. That's how, how it goes in the country. Sometimes you... You uh, learn how to drive things at a very young age, just because you have to. They're fun, you know, driving tractors. You make it makes you feel like you're a king on the road. And then uh, one of the the farmers was showing me all these tricks that he could do. He could do wheelies with the tractor, which is quite scary to be inside of the cab of when he's doing it. But uh, yeah, there you go. You got nothing to say about that, Stinky? But what's the tractor gonna do? Plough a field. You might have to hook up something behind it. Oh. Like a, a plower or a, a cedar or something. And then didn't it have, when you pressed the options thing before, didn't it have a game objectives or something? And what are those things I with don't the. Know. You've got poor and. See if you can run over those four things that are next to the fence. 
Yeah, here you go. It does remind me of uh, Farmville a bit, but a lot more complicated. Because I think this one. Do you want to sell cows? You don't want to sell cows, do you? I want to feed the cow, but how do I do that? With hay. So you've probably got a hay shed somewhere. How can I get out first? Drive! What? No, not that way. Ah, you're on your own there. See? <laughs> I'm trying to. Spidey's there. I'll chat in a second. Give me a minute. Sorry I'm late. That's fine, Spidey. It's good to see you. Now, while, <coughs> while you're here as well, actually, I'll wait until he says he can chat. Because I was thinking, anyone that has a PlayStation, if you would like to join us as a host, uh, we can do that party thing that we did with uh, Mitch last week because he ended up uh, being quite good at doing the commentary with me and I know we've done it with Spidey once before but that was through Discord so and again like you can do it through Discord but I just don't know how to make the microphone or the sound coming from you sound better because uh, when we did it with Spidey it wasn't as clear as when we did it with Mitch. Yeah, for some reason, if you do it on the PlayStation, it's the commentary is quite clear. So there you go. And PewDiePie, because you're new to the channel, um, we call it our, we don't like calling them fans, we call them the DLG. And pretty much everyone in the chat is a hardcore DLG member. They've been around for a long time. They're very friendly. Uh, they're happy to talk to you and everyone else. See these things that are lit up here? Why don't you try and, like, drive over it? Or if not, um... If you can't... Me out. It says refuel, so you might be able to do that. Because that looks like a fuel tank right there. Which is another common thing on farms. At least the ones that I've seen, they often have their own fuel. Do you know that? You're doing well. Here, yeah, run over. Okay, don't run over. See all of these things that you can just right in front of you, but no, yeah, 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 no. Oh, okay. <laughs> don't get stuck on something again. I want but to get out. The, this thing here, I think you can hook up onto the back of the tractor. It looks like something that will hook onto the, the back of it that you can start dragging across a field or I'm not too oh. sure. I'm really hoping Mitch will come back, although he said he mainly drove him. Hit the one that easier. <laughs> well, technically, I didn't pick this game, Stinky. You did. But that's the only one left. Well, that's true. I didn't didn't think it was going to be quite so complicated. Do you want me to do a bit of a search? Search of what? How to play this game. It's gotten us out of trouble before. All right, hang on. You gotta do a tiny little bit of background stuff here. Try and get Stinky going. Da, 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 da. Hey, that doesn't mean you start playing with your phone. Mm -hmm. What I can do? Nothing. You want me to go to the wrong way and get lost? Um, no, you're on your farm now. So How that's... about you tell me? Why you like bacon and egg rolls so much? I don't get it. Bacon and egg rolls are delicious. What are you talking about? But it's so full and it's just basically protein and carbs. You don't put any veggies in there, did ya? You don't even put tomato in there. Or onions. Um... Why do you like it so much? <laughs> I don't understand it. Because bacon tastes good. Yeah, then why don't you just eat bacon? Why it has to make in the roll? Egg tastes good with bacon in a roll with cheese and tomato sauce and a bit of pepper. And yeah, if I could be bothered, I'd put in garlic and onion and fried tomato. But did I get any help from you? No. So am I going to put in that extra effort? Heck no. Uh, all right. I don't know how I'm going to do this, Stinky, because... Realistically, I need to be able to hear what's going on in the 
the game. Oh, all right. All right, see, this is what you do. Oh, that looks difficult. No, you just... I have to be able to control this stupid car. Yep, you got it, well, tractor, but yes, you got to... See, they've hooked stuff up onto the back of these, your tractor. Hook oh, stuff up onto the back of it. I have to hook it first. How do you hook it? Well, we're getting to that. No, I don't want to see your intro. I just want to see you get into it. Did you watch the loading video to get tips or ideas? No. Oh. Loading video. What is loading video? I guess the first screen one. Oh, Red's saying it's snowing where they are now. Wow. Oh, my it's goodness. a beautiful day here, Red. Complete sunny sky. Uh, but I believe the dogs enjoy the snow there. And then she goes out and does the skating in the park and so on. Um, all right. Hold on, can you do ice skating? Um, I have ice skated when I was young, once or twice. So, yeah, I did that too. That doesn't help. That doesn't really count as what you're telling me. I mean, I still can't skate. Do you use the koala or kangaroo thingy? To help you to support you go ice skating no but uh we went as a school class and the girls helped me uh, i pretended i couldn't skate so they grabbed me by the hand uh, and skate with me you shaky yep <laughs> so the girls are bigger than you no no they just uh wanted to date me i think no, they just busy on you. So I had one girl on each arm, I did. Uh-huh. You're not impressed you? by... How, how old was you? Well, I was still in my, my hometown, so I must have been young. Oh, Probably... Primary? Pro yeah, possibly. I might have been like 10 or 11, maybe 12. Attach! I got it attached! See, there you go. You don't, don't need my help. I don't even know what it means. What is this for? I don't know, you just go and start tearing up a field somewhere. Okay, go. <laughs> oh, what is that? I don't even know what it is. That's why I'm like, what's that? I am not too sure what you've got on the back of that thing. Maybe it could be a hay, hay baler, maybe. Does it require another attachment to get on the back of that? Look at that. doesn't do anything. It looks like another attachment going on. Well, you, that shed over there is... Oh. No, 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 don't do that. That shed over there has got a lot of stuff that you can muck around with. Mm -hmm. And this tutorial is really not helping whatsoever, I've got to say. Mm -hmm. This is a waste of time by the look of it. Mm. Now, which one should I get? Get the big one. Get huh? the... Hang on, Dave, give me another camera angle. Yeah, like one of these ones on the left there, in front of you, like the okay. Pottinger Boss Alpin. I was going to say Alpine, but I don't think it was. Oh man, this is the most ridiculous tutorial I've ever seen. We haven't yeah. even gotten out into the farm and the video's almost over. Well, I guess the tank ones might be sprayers. Uh-huh. Therefore, um, I don't need it yet. No, you don't need that yet. Where's my farm anyway? <laughs> well, I guess the farm's all around you, isn't it? Don't you have this, like, space that is your farm that is, yeah, you know, the... not a public area or not someone else's farm? Well, how do I know? Actually, so... I might be able to go for a map. Where's the map? See if you can find a field that actually has something growing in it already. Maybe. I don't think it's something very close here. 
I'd say you're probably going to struggle with that. Uh-huh. And do you want me to keep looking for tutorials? Because so far I've had no luck. Don't worry about it. I can try whatever. Or maybe I'm just go drive, pretend this is GTA, smack out the car. It's too early for snow, says Red. She also says it's so wonderful having stink pants here. You see, Stinky, she doesn't believe me, Red. That I keep telling her that the DLD ask about her and where is she and why isn't she streaming. We don't like her, Uncle Poodot, he's boring. Stinky's the one that provides all the entertainment. That's what they say. Not true. <laughs> And you keep talking. Well, that's my interpretation of what they're saying. Uh oh, I don't want this one. Uh, yeah, go for uh, one of the red ones. It's not easy to control this thing, all right? <laughs> you're doing well. Look at you. You're backing up nicely. No jackknifing, except for now you're jackknifing and destroying the thing behind you. But that's okay. Or, alternately, you can what sort of. Thing go? Alternately, you can sort of drive around all the buildings and just see what, what else is there. Because from that one video I watched, Detach. they had a much, much bigger uh, thing that you could put on the box. Uh, Pudok Games in Circles. That is exactly what happened last week. It took Mitch to download the game to start playing, and he finished it so quick compared to me. I spent the first hour and a half running around in circles. Look, I think this is the field. There you go. You know what you're doing now. Huh? You got a lot. <laughs> does it what? have? Does it have a you what are, are you here? What are talking about? Does it have like a you are here thing on it? Don't you see in the middle there that got like um, the diamond four white thing? things? I think that's, that's where, where you we are. are. I think. All right. Well then I'd say... Uh, I think! But I don't know! I don't know what I'm doing! Which one should I get first? Go for the... Field number one. <laughs> yeah, but you have to get something, right? Well, that's why I said they, they might have more farming equipment somewhere because... I don't think so. I think you have to get it from here oh. before you go to the field. Yep. This well, is I'm... where is the shred where your vehicle park. Yep, and I'd say attach that sucker. Which one? Um, Left, right. Whichever one you can actually attach at this point. I think if you can just get something on the back of it, that's a good start. And I'm not even sure if... Oh, you're lined up nicely. Yeah, but that's like... Stop, stop, stop. Attach point. I think you're attached now, eh? Yeah. Well, off you so. go. I don't even know what this for. We're about to find out. Look at this. Whoa, look at that. Uh, hang on, I don't think you're attached correctly. <laughs> that doesn't matter, keep going. <laughs> I'm not attached correctly. You got two wheels off the ground, four wheels off the ground. <laughs> you're driving with your front two wheels on the, the tractor. And then attach. attach. But it's like this. Oh. It's no, then go. Out. There, you're good. Oh, Seth Schaefer Gaming is there. Long time no see to you too. How have you been? More of the DLGs showing up. It's good to see you. Uh, how's the weather? How's the, the life for the Seth Schaefer Gaming? Oh, wow. How did you do that? He's he's put a Poodot stink pants that's in a different colour. Uh, you're good. That's good to hear. Uh, I don't suppose you play have ever played this game, have uh -oh. you, Seth? Because uh, Stinky's struggling quite a bit. Where should I go? To left, probably. From Hit that map. car. Too late. From the map, maybe turn left. So I'm good since my character changed. So what character is this, Seth? Oh, hang on, did I read that right? Snide. Snide, my character changed? Am I... Snice. I don't know what Snice is. I think he meant sense. Okay, so at the moment we're kind of struggling with the game. And to be perfectly honest, I've gone on plenty of tangents when it comes to the conversation because I had no real topics prepared. 
other than have you experienced anything mysterious? Which he probably asked this before. Oh, last the one year. with blue eyes. Yeah, I probably ask it every October, isn't it? But isn't it? I usually ask scary rather than mysterious. What's different? Isn't well, mysterious somewhat? Mysterious isn't necessarily scary. Yeah, but isn't that somewhat? But scary can be mysterious. Um, I don't know, like, uh, for example, coming across an animal that you've never seen before is mysterious, but not necessarily scary. Do you know what I mean? Like, were you when I first showed you a blue tongue lizard? Were you scared? No. Was it a bit mysterious because you'd never seen a blue tongued lizard before? No, it's just lizard. It's just <laughs> yeah, it looked different. It looked like a fat little thing with big blue tongue. Yeah, it's not even big. So if it's like Komodo dragon, which is very big, then that's scary. Have you seen a goanna yet? Um, not the real one. All right. Did I tell you I went to university, a university campus that had goannas? Yeah. They used to walk around the campus stealing people's food and no one would stop them because of how big they are. It was quite scary to be sitting on the grass and then all of a sudden this gigantic lizard walks up to your backpack and rifles through it and takes all your food. No. Okay, how come you got goanna here? It's not from Australia. Yeah, goannas are an Australian animal. Huh? Mm. It's a large lizard. Isn't that from Africa or America? Are you thinking of like a Komodo dragon which looks similar to... No, Komodo to... dragon is Indonesia. Um... Huh? Meh? <laughs> Search! I doubt it's not Australian. Goannas. I think it's different kind of lizard that is Australian. So Seth said that he's uh, about to watch the Five Night at Freddy's movie. I saw something about that. Oh, is it the new one in the cinema? Put up. You wanna watch? Ah, we can do that. Get me my free popcorn. No, my discounted popcorn. So, a goanna is any one of several species of lizard, Varanus, Varanus oh. found in Australia and Southeast Asia. Oh, See? you call that guana? I thought you're talking about iguana. Iguana? No, I'm talking about a goana. Hilarious. What's iguanas, the difference between guana and dog? Iguanas are small compared to a goana. Goannas are huge. Let me see if I can Is do it. it. The, is it the big one with the goanna, goanna? The iguana is a small with one. With a small that's... leg? Like, not, not small, but like, not long leg, choppy. Goanna are the choppies? No, see this, uh, that's a small That goanna. looks like the choppy. Look, look at this one with the Aboriginal. That's a goanna, that's a rather bigger, large bigger, one. Bigger, bigger, bigger. So that's a big goanna. <laughs> Why did he hail it like that? They eat goannas. It's part of their staple diet back in oh, the day. Oh, that's that. almost like a Komodo dragon. See, that's what I said. I don't want to hack it like that. No, you probably shouldn't. And plus their, their mouths are full of bacteria. Why? Not, not good to get bitten by one of those things. You're going to know about it. How can they use this thing? You're doing well. <laughs> Thanks. So, are you going on a, a horror movie watching bender set during Halloween? Is that what people do? Because I noticed on Foxtel they are recommending a lot of scary movies. Stinky yeah. watched one of them, didn't you? Huh? What did they that watch? Was it Annabelle or some, it's some huh? girl's name? Not Annabelle. You said Sophia? Annabelle. Sophie? Like you watched a movie the other day and you said I've heard about this and it's the movie title is a girl's uh, name. That's all I know. I can't remember. Ah, fishbowl memory. I can't remember. You're a fishbowl. But I, I do remember the story. I just don't remember the name of the movie. What? <laughs> it's easier to remember the name of the movie than the storyline. Uh, and I even know that it's a prequel of the movie called X. But I don't know the name of the movie. 
<laughs> what? <laughs> That's not your. They're getting introduced to your non witch laugh now. This is Stinky's natural laugh, isn't it? We don't get to hear that that much, do we, Stink? Usually it's the old witch laugh. Ah, oh, dear. So maybe we should uh, go on a bit of a, a horror movie watching bender this weekend, do you think, Stink? Oh, yeah. Sound like a good plan. If you want? No, there's heaps of movies that they're recommending at the moment on on uh, Foxtel. They've even got a whole line that says Halloween movies. You see? Uh, That's what you're about. Okay. Put on. I might need toilet soon. Already. And that might be number two. Oh, that's probably too much information. <laughs> yeah, but I'm gonna be away for a bit. No. Hold it in. <laughs> Yeah, I could take AV if you want, but maybe you just go when you really, really need to go, not like your usual self. You I'm see what I'm saying? I'm in for a bit. Oh, is it? Well, then I can try and uh, take over for a little bit. Oh, did I detach it? No. You got a 3D, 360 what? degree camera there. Don't even know what I'm doing. I think. I have to figure out first which, which, which machine is doing what. For which field. And I actually figure it out, this is the field. Oh, you got the right field. No, 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 no. Um, I'm talking about, like, you see the numbers, right? Yes. It's actually the field that we have to go and harvest or grow something. Yes. Um. So if you actually looking at something and set it as a target, then maybe that's how it works. But I'm not quite sure how to do that yet. Well, you're on your way. And they also have, I don't know how did I do that. It's show here. See? Oh. It's like. It's oh, you've got fields ready to harvest. Ready to harvest is the yellow one. And Orin growing is the right? green one. Yeah, so you gotta to go to an orange field, but you need a Yeah, but you need the right tool for the right field. So I don't even know what I'm doing. And so well hang on. Do you know which field you're in at the moment? Mm, probably none of them. <laughs> it does look like you're in a paddock. But which one is beyond me, I don't know. I, but maybe over across the road there, you can see a bunch of fields, yeah, right? Yeah, that's why I'm saying this one doesn't look right. Uh-oh. No, don't leave. <laughs> don't, don't. Go back. Don't leave it. Oh, Karen Davis is there as well. Hi, Karen. It's good to see you. Uh, that's the second second stream in a row. She's... She, oh, sorry. I'm not sure Karen can be both a male or a female name. So just uh, let me know if I've got that right. By default, I always say he. I don't know why. Maybe I'm old school. So, again, Stinky's kind of struggling with his game at the moment, and old Uncle Budok's not, <laughs> not giving her much help. <laughs> so, how have you been? And if you can give any advice on, on this game, it'd be appreciated, but I have a feeling only Mitch can really help at this point. And I don't think he played the game, he was just driving around. Using it like a driving game, isn't it? Are you going to be celebrating uh, Halloween in the next couple of days? Going to a Halloween party and, and that sort of thing? Oh, see, you don't have that other attachment now. Now it's flat on the ground. Uh oh, No, that, that's a good thing. It's a good thing. At least your thing's on the ground now as opposed to two wheels. I have to come back to get that thing. Yeah, look, you, it might actually harvest. Or do something. Nothing, because this one looks like a, like a normal field, public, flowery, non-crop field. Right, so then go back to your map and try and figure out where you are. And put on the green thing, whatever, and aim for one of those ones that needs to be mowed down. Where am I? 
that's why I was saying, does it have a you are here function to it, which it doesn't look like it does, right? You might be able to work it out from <clears throat> from the landmarks. So you got a river, for example. Do you know where the river is? No, not yet there. But I got the cow paddock before and the tread. So I just turn left or something. Sounds like a good plan. No. Not a good plan? No. Oh. Well, that's no good. Ah! Uh, so so we... I got <laughs> gone. That's it. Keep driving around until it looks like it starts to mow things. And I'm not I sure. Have to leave that thing over there. <laughs> I'm not sure if you have to turn it on as well. I don't know. Because that. I don't know. See, it's got like a black thing at the front there. That looks like it's gonna gonna um, sweep things up or cut things down, but it's not moving. Geez, you're getting good at your driving now, though. Look at that. You're oh, right on the road. Because we attach this thing here. No, 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 no. So it, it goes slower. Oh. And don't worry about the other cars on the road. Your, tr could... your tractor's bigger. So they have to that get... That is not a goal. <laughs> they have to get out of the road. Have you? Unless it's a truck, in which case, you know, go for it. See what happens. You got a couple of pedestrians there you can run over if you so choose to do. Right, there's your river, right? Mm -hmm. So you're right next to the river now. Mm -hmm. And then... This is a US way. And European way. <laughs> Damn it, I have to be on the right. That's right. Me. Have you ever done that? Nope. Driven on the other side of the road? No. Nope. I did when I went to America. It took a bit of convincing, mate, that my relatives were saying, oh, you'll be fine. And I said, I don't think you understand. We do drive on the other side of the road in our country. The steering wheel's on the other side of the road, too, on the other side of the car, too. And you're expecting me to drive in an uh -oh. eight-lane highway? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Ah! <laughs> That's an over, over about, not a roundabout. Just go over it. Over about? Um. See, I think you, you're on the right track because you've got the the um, river next to you on the right-hand side. Well, now it's on the left. Right. Ah. You're doing well, Stinky. Sooner or later we'll get something harvested. Maybe a road sign. You think you can do that? Harvest a road sign? I'm stuck! <laughs> Again! No! Put up! Uh, and turn! I'm gonna be the one who picked the game! You did pick From the, the downloading! Alright, oh, okay. Yep, you can do that. If you want me to do this... Uh, I just... I this honest... turned out to be a driving game. <laughs> I honestly thought, thought you'd like it because you like the garment, the farming games and this is a farming game. Probably well, have to look more into it, like what kind of farming is this? Alright, all kinds. So Red asked, what city did you visit in the US? Alright, so I landed in San Francisco. Uh, then from there, uh, I went to... Is it Roseville? I think it's called Roseville. I can go there with you, don't ask me. And that's <laughs> that's where I stayed for most of the time was in Roseville. Um, we did whatever's in and around San Francisco. Um, what's where's Sani Schwarzenegger? The, yeah, I know he's the governor of California, but he's local or was the governor of California, and his local seat is. Oh, if you said it, I'd say that's the place, but I can't think of it for now. And then uh, we also went interstate for a little bit into Nevada. And when I was there, I went to San Remo 
and one other town somewhere around that lake uh what's the lake lake tahoe is that right i am so, yeah well but you know i'm really bad when it comes to traveling i can't really remember the names of, but yeah drive over it i can't remember the names of places but i think i've done all right I think I've done all right with uh, answering Red's question. So, Roseville, um, San Francisco. I cannot remember the name of that city or town that's outside of San Francisco. And then, yeah, a little bit in Nevada as well. So it was quite, quite uh, interesting. I would have loved to have explored a lot more of America, but basically when I was there, I was working as well. So it wasn't, uh, I was a driver amongst other things. Can you believe that? Someone that has no experience driving on American roads doing a job as a driver. Uh -huh. uh, it wasn't the only job that I was doing there, but um, yeah. Uh oh, I don't have it. Disappear. Let's do a city tour. Yep. <laughs> That's all you need to do, city tour of, of the... Oh, uh... see that? Nope. This is the field now, see that? Well then, that looks like something that needs to be harvested. I don't have anything to... <laughs> my, my machine's gone. That's so cool. When were you in the US and how long did you stay? So, I was there for a month and again, old Uncle Pudot's memory is not great, but it would have been... Well, it was before I met you, so that's... Mm -hmm. How long have we had the privilege of knowing each other? That's it's a long time long now. Time. Like More six, than 10 years now. It's like 16 years now, isn't it? Uh, I met you when you, we were... Well, I'm not going to say the exact ages, but you know. And that's that's got to be around 16 years now. Time for a change! No. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, want... Welcome! Yeah, you would, wouldn't you? You'd be all about that. Oh, what are you doing? So I think it was back in the early 2000s, like maybe 2002, something like that. So, yeah, I didn't, uh, we didn't know that, well, not that we didn't know, but I didn't know that I had relatives in America. So, and they were looking for people to come and work with them, but um, no offence to Americans, it's really got nothing to do with Americans or America, but um, yeah, I love I love Australia. I didn't, when I was there, I didn't think that I would make a, a happy life for myself. Now, you got to bear in mind, and, and sorry Stinky for bringing up the past, but blah, at, that, blah, blah. at that time I hadn't broken up with my ex for that long. So I was extremely lonely and they want, one of the things that they were considering to get me to do is to go and manage a, a set of um, units, like uh, apartments. And it was in some smaller town in, in uh, California. And I just thought, I'm not, never even gonna meet a girl here. And I asked the, the guy oh. that was working there prior to me and I said do you, what do you do because you're single as well and he just said he went to the the uh, naughty places he would go to the topless bars and things I'm like well that doesn't you know that's not really going to get you a girlfriend and uh, well look it all turned out well in the end didn't it because if I had taken up on all of that I wouldn't have to endure such a torturous life with stinky I'm joking there, Stinky. You're not even listening to me anyway, are you? I could say whatever I like, and you'd be like, that's right. Um, but we would, I'd like to go back. There, there's much more of America that would be awesome to explore. Um, and there's a lot of food that I want to try. I think Texas has got to be on the list because they have good food in Texas with all that barbecue stuff. And um, you with the barbecue. Oh yeah, but you know, I was in California. And we didn't go to Hollywood. We didn't go to uh, San Diego. These are the sort of places I would have liked to have visited. Mm. And the one thing that I was most disappointed with was that I never got to surf there. Mm. 
because mm. I like to try and surf in every Goodness. country that has surf. Although I'd struggle a bit now in my old age, wouldn't I? Mm. Doubt I'd be able to find a surfboard that could carry my weight. <clears throat> so there you go. What about uh, yourself or anyone else in the chat? Have you travelled a lot? Have you been overseas? Would you like to? Where would you like to go? Uh, we were talking about Mexico a lot last night just because we had uh, Mexican for dinner and I spoke to a friend who, uh, this is through the Hello Fresh, which I guess you people would know, not a sponsor. I probably shouldn't mention them, but maybe we should approach them for a sponsorship seeing as we use their products a lot. And anyway, I would uh, offered some free food to a mate of mine and he said, yeah, I'll try that out. So we started talking about it and I said to him that their Mexican meals are quite nice but I'd like to try the real thing because when I see the cooking cooking shows on TV there's a lot of meals that I've never seen in Australia um, and I'd like to try them. They, they look like they'd be absolutely delicious. All about the food when it comes to travelling. Stinky's a bit different, aren't you? you? You don't mind checking out the sights and sounds, whereas I'm more attracted to what's the food there. <laughs> well, just because we don't know. In your own country, you don't know how good it is because it's not from your country, right? Like you've had... Do you think the, the Italian in your country is not as good or better than the Italian in our country? I don't know. I think ours is better. Because you're used to it. Yeah, and plus we've got a lot more Italians here, like actual Italians. So, but I don't know how authentic it is because we haven't been to Italy. I know our pizzas are not but authentic. authentic doesn't always mean better. Mm, like, because you're just used to it from your own country. Yeah, but... So you kind of like, uh, I like my country more, even though it's not authentic. So then that's one of the things that I don't like about Australia, the fact that they... Yeah, let's see if you rip up. Actually, that looks like it's growing, not ready for harvesting. Well, this one actually... It's not harvesting not anyway. Not for the harvest one anyway. I'm going to the... Where is it? Where is the brown one? Over there. Well, that's for growing, isn't it? Yep. Have you got seeds in your thing? You might. I don't know. We're going to do something. There you go. You've found the fields. Yeah, you're on your way. Yeah, but Leaving I don't know tracks all like that. Keep going a little bit. Thing. I want to see if you're leaving a track behind you because it looks like you are. Oh, maybe not. Yes, you are. <laughs> going diagonally across the field. Nice work. Uh, where were we? So, yeah, that's one of the things I don't like about Australia, that they often manipulate the food to suit the old white Australian taste. And it's like, well, that's not the real deal. Like, the, for example, the Thai food, Stinky. Thai food from Thailand is so much better than from here. Except for maybe the restaurant you work at. They've, they've got some, some good stuff. What are you looking for? One hour. Oh, is that it? You want to... That's it? You're done? Well, I reached the destination that I can't do anything. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, this might be a very short stream today. Stinky is specifically looking for the one hour mark. I guess the chat's been a tad quiet too. So... Are we doing it? Are we pulling the plug there, Stink? That's up to you. Well, I have to say yes because I don't know how to use it. I'm get to the destination, ha ha ha! But then what? So Red's... This one actually said potting gear, so it's like seeding machine? Could, I don't even it know could what... be, because it certainly doesn't look like a harvester. It's pretty small. Although I did say there's something at the front there that looked like it might harvest something. Mm. Red December said, my city is a melting pot of food diversity. That's what you want, isn't it? Lots of different food in the one place. Although we went to that, that uh, what did you call it? The food, 
food expo or something, which I was not that impressed with. You weren't either, though. You didn't think the food there was that good. So I'd like to try it. That's what we're into. You name it, Red, we'll try it. Creole food, that's what I want to try in America. Bit okay. of Creole, bit of jambalaya. Okay. And uh, also soul food as well. I, I want to see what that's about. I have no idea what they are. Different styles of cuisine, Stinky. Yeah, but I never experienced it at all, so no idea. All right, so... Uh, put that on the drive! I don't even know how to. So we might end up uh, ending the, the stream early, Red. Sorry if I can't get Stinky to... Oh, hang on here. Yeah, can you harvest this? This looks no. like a harvestable field. I don't think so. I don't think I got the right machine. Let's see. Did it do anything? Nope. <laughs> nope. Well, well then. <laughs> Maybe we should just go for a drive up on that bridge. What do you think? You can do that. I'm going to the toilet. Does that mean you're not coming back? Mm -hmm. uh, all right. Well, I'd say thank you to the DLG for joining us for this really short stream today. Um, I'll try and get a, another video uploaded this week because I really wanted to get into that sniper wolf stuff and I'm already too late found something that no one else had and then they found it two days after me so That's it's not always too late it is because i'm not very good at editing it takes very long to do that to me so any final words you want to say anything to red there she's been quietly listening to me rubbish on <laughs> thanks for hearing the rubbish from poo dot <laughs> <laughs> have a good one and oh yeah have a great party i think red's gonna have a halloween party nice what are you gonna wear well go to one she did actually post a i actually know she posted a video of decorations so i'm not sure what she's gonna wear but i'm sure it'll be something good she's got good fashion sense all right okay. so take Bye it guys. easy everyone we'll see you in the next one sorry this one's kind of short all right you know how to turn it off stinky you, you are don't the one do you